Hey y'all, Board Game Answer, where you'll find everything solo tabletop gaming and more, and welcome to part two of my playthrough of the Lost Relic scenario on Mage Knight. It is the night. The night has come. We are safe in our keep, but it's not meant to last. We're gonna hire some buds and go kill some bad guys. So please keep in mind, I might screw up, uh, language might get a little salty depending on what happens. You know, I'm just doing this for fun. Let's just have some fun. I need to get out into that, out into the night. But not before I hire some, some cannon fodder. <laughs> I know I've got this uh, influence here. Uh, I've kind of figured out I need, uh, this, so these are the only two I can hire because they're the only ones I can hire in a key. I need 14. She would need, it would multiply my, Reputation, which is zero, so 14 again, I think. And I can use this to get an extra two influence. My chaos, I can use this token for three influence, or one fame, or for its power. So three, four, five. Uh, and then now I need to power these up. Well, let's see, what do I need? Five, 11, if I power this up. Five. 14, okay, so if I, so, but I have to power both these up. So I don't want to touch my move. I've got this to gain. I don't really want to use that if I don't have, but I need, I need two. So, all right, so I'm going to use the one over here for that. Uh, it's just too bad I don't have any wounds. <laughs> it's weird to say, but because then I could have used it up there. Oh, well, whatever. Okay, and then maybe I'll just use concentration here to bring in a red. Instead of using my crystal, just power that, right? Okay, and that's going to affect my rep. I'm going to go down one this time. I'm going to do it right. You saw my last video. What did I get? So 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. There it is. Okay, so we're good. We're set. We're going to bring on these heroes. Hey. Welcome. I promise. I will... No, I'm definitely going to throw you under the bus. No promises. But not before I've used you, as Mage Knights do. Okay, that I think is going to be it for my first turn. Let's clean on up here. We've got, use this, re-rolling that. Another green. Okay. We discardy. This has been used. That's gone there. This is a... Uh, current hand we need we're at the keep we're five so we get an extra card oh there's that wound son of a gun all right wow got my midnight meditation here let me think on this all right so i've been kind of look at i need to move i gotta move and i gotta move fast and i'm trying to figure out if i want to move left or right and in thinking of that i mean i can with my Song of Wind, I can move through this water, but that costs a blue mana. I don't want to eat or a crystal. And it's just too expensive. And I think I'm going to go left just because I can backtrack into here, whereas here, I got to go that way. So I feel like I've got more options if I go left. So let's, that's going to be the plan. We're going left. And we, so yes, I need to decrease the cost of moving. That's going to do it. Plains, deserts, and wastelands reduced by two. So that wasteland I got to go through is, uh, is just move two now. But I need more. So I'm going to do that. So we've got, yeah, six right now. And we're moving. Here we go. So this is three, four, five. Okay, that was, <laughs> that's it. All right. Well, uh, maybe I'm going to have to. Do I want to power this for... So this this will bring me to three more move, which will expose a tile. Yeah, I'm going to have to stop anyway, because I don't have any way to... F I mean, I've got some guys here. Oh, i got some attack. You know, I got two, four. I got some attack, but I'd, I'd rather have an... If I have to attack something... So I got move three. I'm not going to power that. Three more move. That's going to be to, to reveal. I'll still have one move left. So this... I guess I should have said where I'm exploring. I think there's only one spot. Yeah, I can only go here, right? So that is going to be like that, I think. 
So that's not, well, okay, so yeah, that could have been bad. This, these are green. Ugh. According to the scenario, those are, are come out green, actually. This is gonna be the red, one of the red bad guys I need to kill off. I've got a castle there. And one move, okay, but if I move one more time, that guy attacks me, which, I mean, I can kill him, but I'd take some, yeah, I'm, I think I'm, oh, but man, it's going to cost five move to get over there. Oh, that is, that's not good. Oh, um, I do get fame, though. I get a couple fame. So one for the new tile, one for exposing where one of the lost relics is. And yeah, I got to, well, range three. Wait a second. No, he's five health. Can't take out that green guy. Dang it. So we'll see what we get. Oh, no, no, no. Done, done. Okay. Rolling. Great. Busted die. That's there. We've played this, this. Okay, this is still kind of a bum hand but now we level up we get this extra token we don't have anybody to put with it but i do get to draw six now um i'm one step away from my keep so yeah i only get to draw three more ah oh, heal that's a good one too yes yes okay man i don't even have enough move to get onto that forest it's five those green guys are, ugh, this is not looking good. I mean, I can't, I got these cluttering up my hand. I can't take damage from those guys. I'm going to have to fight them. This is going to slow me way down. This is not looking good. So, yeah. I mean, I've got, I'm going to, I'm going to heal. I'm going to use that. I'm going to heal these up. Bye-bye wounds. But, I've got to fight those guys now. And... I, I can't I don't even have enough move to get anywhere. So I gotta fight these guys. Fortunately, they're cumbersome. So that's a nice thing. Because that's I mean, it's still each one of these would do a damage to me. Or 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 I wanna save those guys. So yeah, I got this sucks. So I'm gonna use move two. Each move that I use allows me to basically negate a point of damage. I think that's how it works. So two. Gosh, I need to do. <laughs> God, this is my range. I don't have any white mana anyway. Oh man, this is not looking good. All right, so four. I, I, I'm dodging all this cumbersome attack from the mob. Now I can attack him. I have to hit him for five, resistant to ice. That's fine. So I can mm, two, two. So that's four, five, six. That's going to kill him. <laughs> Use my whole... <laughs> oh, for these little guys? Come on. Oh, and I healed too. At least I still got my... This sucks. All right. Well, I'm going to get two fame. Increase my reputation. Oh, man. Okay, we get a little token-y thing here. What's that? Uh, one of these. What do we got? Ooh. That sure looks nice. <clears throat> Don't know what it does. Uh, Amulet of Reawakening. Pick a card at random from your discard pile and put it on the bottom of your D deck. Your hand limit is one higher the next time you draw cards. Hmm. Don't want to draw a wound on that one. Card at random. Okay. All right. Or, again, one fame or three influence. But, yeah, I think that's going to be one that I'll, that I'll utilize. Um... We used everything on that. Rolling this up. Green die again. We're in trouble. Hopefully I can kill one of these red guys before the night's over, right? Um, okay, we get to draw six. Jeez. <laughs> Not looking good, folks. Not looking good. Oh. There it is. Uh, let's assess. And looking at the fact that I don't have very many cards in here left, I grabbed my, my discard there. I'm going to bring it over here. We're going to shuffle it up. A little one-handed style. And um, 
Yeah. Something real fancy like that. And then I think I just pick a random one. Um, uh, we'll cut it. Okay, how about that? Right there. This is going to be it. Oh, great. It's going to be a move on the bottom of our deck. Which, great. We might be able to scoot over and see what we need to... This is not looking good. Anyway, that allows me to take an extra card. We have some distance to travel. We got we got to get to that red guy. Now, I mean, it's do I think I only have like the dummy players moving right along. Yeah, I got to go. We got to go. I need 5. I need 7. Oh my gosh, I need 7 movement. <sighs> okay. Mana draw always comes in handy for getting getting some goods here. When you have a white goddamn die. <laughs> Or mana, or crystal, which I've got none of. So can I change it? Play this. Okay, it's blue. Gain a crystal of any color to your inventory. Could do that. Turn that into white. <laughs> kind of know what's in it. Blue. Huh. Gain a crystal of any color to your inventory. Sure will. There's that white one. Boom. We go over here to mana draw. Take a mana die from. The source and set it to any kit. Taking this guy. What do we need? We need move. Massive move. I might be moving. I should be thinking probably a little more about this. But what else? We're making this red. Where is it? Where's it? Okay. About to freak out there. Okay, we're keeping that. So I still haven't technically moved a or, or used a, a mana. So maybe, maybe I shouldn't use it. Maybe I should use blue. Ooh, yeah. Well, well, let's do that. Let's do blue. Yeah. Come here. Come here. Okay. I'm getting two blues. Two blues. Here we go. Now, so we've taken a mana die from the source, set it to any color except gold. We've taken two mana tokens of that color. Do not reroll this die when we return it to source, but I still haven't technically used a die. I've taken a die. I've not used a die. Now I'm going to use this. So wait, wait, we got four. We got move four. We need five, six, seven to get over to that bad guy. We're gonna do it. We're gonna get there. Um, so four. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Maybe I should have used red. Maybe I should make that red. I don't know. Wait, white. Range attack. <gasps> oh, that could be huge. Range attack. Oh my gosh, look at that juicy thing. Holy moly. Hmm, if, if that, I mean, I don't even know what it's going to be, but if we could take it out, it's not, it's not, you know, it's in a city, but it's in this scenario that red is, is not fortified because it's destroyed the city and now it's just hoarding treasure. We're trying to find the lost relic that it's hoarding. We've got to kill it. Let's make this white. Yeah. Yeah. Cause then we got dodge and weave and that. Yeah. Yeah. White's good. White's good. All right, changing my mind again. <laughs> All right. So now we're going to have to use this red. No, this red. Wow, we can use this red. Yes, yes. Then we're going to... I'm not getting rid of dodge and weave. I need this move too. So we'll get rid of this. Yeah. So we're going to discard this to get move five, six, seven. We're in. <clears throat> and most likely in trouble. We're about to find out. Okay, the fun part. Moving on up. So five, reveal. I mean, we're going in. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what this thing is. Six, seven. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> oh, dang it. Oh, it's got resistance. This raged attack, seven. Oh, man, for a fleeting second there, I was so excited. But no, alas, I need 14. You son of a bitch. Okay. All right. I, can, I mean, we can do this. So, going to have to block. can block. Five. That's easy. Ooh, no, we definitely want to block. I'm using a block. So, we need that range. We need that seven attack. We're going to need that seven attack. So we ain't messing, we ain't futzing around with that. 
block here, block here. Okay, this is going to be our block. Well, wait, 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 wait. So let's say I use this. And we go with reducing the enemy attack by four. He's down to one. <laughs> so I don't want to block that. Just block it with this, I guess. There we go. That's plenty of block there. So I'm not going to take any damage because I blocked all this. Now, I get to hit him. I have to hit for 14. Frickin' A. All right, so seven, eight, nine, because I didn't take any damage. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. And I can use that, 14, 15. Okay, got him. All right. First bad guy dead. We get six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Damn it. Could use some more of that. Um, we do get one of these. Excellent. Oh my. So I think that's if I, I've seen this, before, you know, if I take damage, um, the first time I take damage, I think I can ignore it and I ignore any effects of it or something like that. I mean, I could just read the thing Cloak of Shielding. Yeah, yeah. Once when your hero is about to be wounded, you may ignore one wound and any additional effects from it. Yes. So that's pretty good. Okay. So this guy is dead. We don't get any extra reputation for that, but. We do get the relic, so to speak, from that. One of the lost relics. Right there we go. You is dead. Uh, I used this die. God bless it. Then this goes back. Uh, we used a crap ton of crystally gunk, but got one of the jobs done. Um, this has all been used. Didn't I use everything? I think so. Well, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> All right, re-rolled. Uh, let's flip this over. Uh, we're going to get, what, six? Um, oh, yeah, these are done. So I've used all my guys. <laughs> I need to make it to the next tile and kill the next red guy uh, with this. Oh, shit. God bless it. The Soul Harvester did not want to come out and help me out. I don't think I can. I don't think I'm getting there. We'll see here. Okay, <laughs> that's a slim chance, I guess. I mean, you're looking at this a little closer that I could, I mean, the dummy's gonna call it next. So I've got this round or this turn and next turn. And if the soul harvester, if I reach the red guy and this somehow survive its attack, which I should be able to do, I can, I can assign damage to these guys. And I've got the right, you know, stuff here. All right, here we go. Let's just get it over with. <laughs> so move two. So move cost of plains, deserts, and wastelands is reduced by two. So basically, I can move across this plane for nothing. Two minutes zero. You may pay, I'm not going to be moving across lakes. I ain't got no blue mana. And the only way I can go up, or go, is up. Can't, can't work that way. Got to stay in this lane. So this is nothing. And this is... This is it. Okay. So you're going like that, and shit. There's going to be no way to get around that guy without... Damn it! I just don't have... Oh, I can focus on it. I just don't have the time. Um, or the resources, really. I mean, I can kill that guy awfully easy, but... Uh, nope. Even if I had blue mana, that would not help me. Um, okay, so I get over here, I do get a one, two, actually, because I reveal the tile and then, okay, okay, okay. Um, but he's in my way. I have to, I have, I have to kill him this turn. And I don't, I mean, what do I got to do that with? <laughs> <laughs> vampiric. What does that vampiric thing mean? See a little symbol there? So I brought this little guy over here. So yes, every, I mean, every, every wound I take, it increases its armor. And if it hurts a unit, it increases its armor. So, I mean, I, I have to fight it. And so, I mean, and, uh, I can't use this. I mean, I have no shot at all. I don't have any shot at all. I mean, I've only got 
Maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh we'll just, we'll just do it, okay? Okay, so I can use this. Three. I can block three. So that's nice. Where's my other block gonna come from? I can't, I cannot take, I mean, I got, oh, so I can flip this for four. So I can kill him if, but not if he goes to five because he hits me. Oh, no, yes. Wait, yes, yes, we'll use this because yeah, because I can, so, so, well, I don't even need to use that then, but maybe I'll need that move. For next turn i don't know okay so block three so hit one one attack would go through i'd have it go to me but i will use this to ignore it and ignore his vampiric ability boom bang bingo bongo now you daizo with a attack of yeah i don't want to use any of that attack of four blast it you've been blasted okay two thing and one rep okay Oh, and then I get the doohickey. What is it? What is it? Wait, didn't I just... Didn't I just have this? No. Why do I feel like I just had that? Yeah, I think I just accidentally... Yeah, I, I just used that. So, okay, this this is the new one, I think. Oh, that's a plus. That's a plus two move. What the heck? Staff concealment. Move to your movement does not provoke rampage in enemies. Well, that well, I guess there would have been no way around that thing. Can ambush this turn also any, but plus two movement. <sighs> Holy shit! Well, okay, let's see here. So, slow it down, slow it down, Jeff. Let's roll. So we're done. We're done. We can't. We're done. We're rolling this. Got a black die. Great. Not not the greatest, but I level up. I do. I level up. So. Um, yeah, let's see what we get here. Uh, cause right, right, leveled up. Boom. Flipping over a couple skills. Hmm. Okay, not bad. Halfy halfsy. What's the halfsy halfsy thing? The other thing's pretty straightforward. But Puppet Master, what's turn? Either keep one enemy token you defeated this turn or discard one previously kept enemy token. Okay, that's not going to do me any good. Because I, I don't have any enemy tokens. I'm not going to. This is it. So this this goes bye-bye. And we reveal another one of these. Oh, shit. You know, i got to look up here. Is anything up here more important that I get? So on some... I, can't, I couldn't take that because that just appeared. But this... I'm going to go for this. Because I can take damage. I can take damage. You can take damage is what I mean. And... This could benefit me. It could, I can turn a card sideways to get four of, of anything, whatever I'm using it for, move, attack, block, and then I get plus one for any unused those guys, which I got one unused, so basically I get a plus five. So that might come in handy. I mean, I, well, it'll come in handy, but I don't know if it's going to do me any good. So let's go ahead. The Oh, then I have to pick this. Is that? Yeah, it's not really. Nah, this this has a. I've got to use the green. I get. I don't think it really matters. So that would go there. I think we're good. I'm, that friggin' just just do it. Okay. Uh, my turn. I draw this now officially in my hand. Um, dummy calls it. We go. Time to just see what happens. Okay, Savage Harvesting, move four. Each time move space. Discard a card to gain a crystal of the same color if you discard. Nope, that's not gonna. Wait, me? I don't know you get. Ah, anyway. Each time you move a space. Well, so four, five, six, seven. So there's that. Right? So that's going to get me there. So here's five, and then we can take a look, and I just got to move right in. So six, seven, we're in. What have we got? Well, we ain't blocking that, but I wasn't too worried. I'm not too worried about the block part because <laughs> I guess I got my heroes over here throwing you under the bus.
take that. Doesn't have any special ability though, so that's nice. So 14, okay, oh, I've got my attack eight. Straight up, 14, we hit it for eight. This is gonna be five because of this ability. Four, instead of uh, attack one, it's gonna be four, plus one is five, so eight. 13, friggin' 14, are you kidding me? We did it, I did it, I'm calling it good, I got it, I killed it with one, With I mean, that was it, that was my entire resource. I even have an unwooded Udom Guardsman. Took it out, got my last relic, beat the scenario. You can also score the scenario. I mean, I might have screwed up here because that seems a little too close, but I'll take it. That is sweet. That is the goodness. That is the good stuff. That is very satisfying. You can score it. I don't really worry about all the scoring and stuff. It just says if you succeed in finding all pieces of the relic, you are victorious. If not, you have failed. I believe I pulled it off by the last hair of my chinny chin chin. That is Mage Knight, one of the quicker scenarios. Allows for just a kind of, kind of quick hit and run version of this mm, game of all games. Hope you enjoyed. Till next time, I'm Board Game Rants, and I'm out.